Hi, welcome to Double Strike Recap. Today I'm gonna review a 2023 American action western film, The Old Way. Spoilers ahead. This story begins with a theft case committed by Jimmy's father against the big boss in the city. Sentenced to hang, he hires Carlton Bridge as a guard for the boss's safety. Suddenly an attack from Jimmy's father's relative came, a shootout between the two sides occurred and the incident resulted in the death of his relative. Jimmy's father was angry and when he was about to attack, Bridge shot him in the head first. Twenty years later, in a hill village far from the settlement, Briggs lives with his daughter and wife Root. As a wife, Root can change her ex-hitman husband's way of life, becoming a good and responsible father figure. Their daughter is named Brooke, she has the same disorder as her father, and she is unable to express feelings of sadness and happiness. One day Bridge took her daughter to a school near the shop where she worked, the school where Brooke studied, temporarily time off because the teacher was sick. Calton took Brooke along going to his shop. In the shop, Brooke caught a customer who was about to steal colorful candies, the customer was frightened and saw the sharp glare of Brooke's eyes fixed on him, so he returned the candy to the jar. After the customer came home, he complained about what happened to Briggs. Remembering that the thief's hands were dirty, Brooke took the initiative to clean up the candy one by one. Meanwhile, from afar, a mysterious figure was watching Root, then he was startled, a young man suddenly appeared before him. Feeling threatened Root puts up a fight so he can flee into the barn and charge through them on his horse, but the escape attempt was thwarted by a shot. Jimmy, who is the leader of the gang, apparently has ulterior motives. Jimmy, who knows Calton Briggs very well, wants to avenge his father's death 20 years ago. After that Briggs found his residence filled with police officers, Sharif Marshal Franklin Jarrett as chairman of its members didn't think that the house belonged to Carlton Briggs, a former assassin he had known. After Briggs found out that his wife had died, he wanted to bury Ruth's body alone without anyone being able to help him, amid a tense atmosphere. Should be sad, it did not happen to Brooke who just stood there watching his mother buried without crying a bit. Briggs was warned by Marshall not to take revenge, letting the police who caught the perpetrator go to the scaffold. Besides that, Briggs had a daughter he had to protect. Behind the killer's barn left a message with the sentence that Briggs had spoken in front of his boss 20 years ago. Then, in a desperate situation he intended to kill his daughter so that it would not become an obstacle in completing his revenge action, but the conscience he learned from his late wife refused that action. Briggs decides to take Brooke along in the action of hunting down the culprit. While Seraph and his crew are patrolling the canyon, they get attacked by Jimmy's gang. Difficult to get Marshall as the main target, Jimmy withdrew his men leaving the cliff. Briggs heard gunshots and immediately went to the source of the sound. Marshall's men came from the opposite direction, giving Briggs the idea to steal the horse he was riding. To distract, Brooke was told to pretend to cry, because he did not know how to cry, he followed the instructions exemplified by Briggs. After that the two of them managed to take Marshall and the rest of his men hostage, Marshall told Jimmy's full name as James McAllister and it turned out that Briggs just either removing the bullets from the gunshot wounds of his men, According to Marshall's estimate of the evacuation Jimmy heads to the city of Sinteros, not immediately believing Calton threatens to kill Marshall and his crew if he lies. In another place, Jimmy and his gang break into an old barn according to the agreement he had to pay his three men after successfully killing Briggs' wife, but the game was not over, he knew full well he had awakened a sleeping lion to make sure Briggs was chasing him, Jimmy tricked his three men, by paying them in ancient London and Mexican currency before divulging the place where the currency applies. His three men must follow Jimmy's latest plan. They also arrive at the City of Stars which is the place where Briggs killed Jimmy's father. In the evening, Calton tells about his disorder, in which cannot cry, or laugh, and has no fear. His past as a murderer is a form of Briggs' attempt to feel fear. Crying and laughing are the two things she learned from her marriage to Root, Briggs begins to feel sadness and a sense of loss. The next morning, considering that there is only one way to enter the city gate of Sintero, Briggs also orders Brooke to enter the city alone to avoid the monitoring of Jimmy's men. Then Brooke enters the shop and pretends to buy something. Jimmy and his gang know the identity of the product from the horse he is riding. The horse was deliberately marked by Jimmy so that he could lead Briggs to chase him into the city. Jimmy lured Briggs out of hiding by holding Brooke. Jimmy buys time by detaining Brooke in the tavern. While there Brooke sees Jimmy has a lot of money which he put in his horse saddle bag. Until time passed. 
Graves appeared and finished off Jimmy Stu's men one by one. Unfortunately in this effort, Briggs' hand was shot. He takes refuge in a building and is again attacked by another gang, but is soon finished off. Jimmy finally creates a moment that is the same as 20 years ago. Briggs is given two options, allowing Jimmy to shoot Briggs in his daughter's presence or Jimmy to shoot his daughter in Briggs' presence. For the first time see Brooke able to express sadness. The deal ended in shootings, Jimmy managed to avenge his father. I did it! Then Brooke you returned to Briggs. avenge Jimmy's actions. Briggs' death has made Brooke feel sad and lost now. Then there was awkwardness when Brooke ordered a servant to fetch Jimmy's bag which contained money, at the end of the story Brooke's expression seemed to reveal his identity again. Hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to get more video like this, turn on the notification and leave a like to help the channel out. Thank you for watching.